Hello and welcome to the RM Network. Today we are talking about the Twilight Zone Season 1, Episode 8, Point of Origin. Now this is an episode I really dug, and it feels like some of the better of this series of the Twilight Zone, because there's a mystery going on throughout the entire part. Piece by piece you start to unravel what the mystery is and the solutions to it, but throughout the entire thing you're still not sure. You never know where it's going to go. Now, this also is a story about immigrants. Now, this lesson, this message that this episode has, is not beaten over your head nearly as much as the last one. But from pretty much the very beginning, I said, oh, I see where this message is. After the very beginning, it's kind of subtly talked about for a while. Then it's kind of more talked about in the closing monologue which I was very happy about. I was very happy they didn't beat it over your head like you did in the last episode. This is how you include a message in the Twilight Zone and do it in a right way. It was really cool seeing the different personality types that were in essentially this government prison-ish area. The main character is someone who has come from a place of privilege, and as you watch her throughout this entire episode, you see... Her act as if she did come from a place of privilege. She doesn't want to touch any of the dirty things. And it's just very subtle details that you notice throughout her performance. I think she does a fantastic job. I think the entire cast does a really good job. Having watched the episode, what I wish there was a little bit more of was some of the spookier aspects. There are all these questions that the episode sets up that, while they don't need necessarily to give answers to, I would have liked to have seen them give answers to because... It is what would have made the episode a lot more interesting. You can't write it solely on the theme of the episode itself, though I do believe that is an important point. I just would have loved to have seen a little bit more of the sci-fi elements that kind of make the Twilight Zone the Twilight Zone. Episodes this season like The Traveler or Nightmare at 30,000 Feet do such a good job at making the sci-fi Twilight Zone elements so prominent that those were the episodes that really engaged me the most. This one and a few of the other episodes that focus a little bit more on the message of the episode, while I appreciate it, especially in this episode, because as I said earlier, this episode doesn't beat you over the head with the message like the previous episode did and kind of a few of the other ones. I really think that the message of the story should always be an underlying factor. It should never compromise the storytelling itself. And while I don't think it's necessarily compromised the storytelling, it certainly drives the storytelling when, in essence, the message should come out of the storytelling, not the other way around. While this is in no means a bad episode, I think it's actually one of the better episodes that we've had so far, I really want this show, whether it be in the next season or in these final two episodes, to take a step back from the more very political, very topical messages and focus a little bit more on what makes the Twilight Zone so much fun. The weird, the goofy, the Twilight Zone. A message can be your underlying goal with the episode, but I want the episodes to focus on the storytelling. Focus on the creepy, focus on the sci-fi. If every once in a while, maybe one episode per season you want to dedicate to a very particular message, I'm fine with that. But I want to see... A lot more focus on the odd, the insane, what makes the Twilight Zone the Twilight Zone. But those are just my thoughts. Thank you so much for watching this video. Let me know in the comments section what did you think of Point of Origin and what has been your favorite episode this season. Make sure as always to like this video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so. When you do subscribe, make sure you hit that little bell icon. It'll notify you when new videos of ours come up. And make sure you check us out on social media at the RM Network on Instagram and Twitter. And you can follow me on social media at Rich underscore Mahalski. All of those links can be found in the description box. Thank you so much for watching this video and every video we put out here. I'll see you next time.